as we know, the temperature is rising with 120 degrees expected in just a couple of days. There's a great need, obviously, for water, especially when we look at those extreme temperatures. Yeah, yeah that's why St. Mary's Food Bank is providing water for those in need, but they need your help. Jamie Serretta is live near 29th Avenue and Dunlap with details. Good morning, Jamie. Hey, good morning, guys. You know, Goodwill is teaming up on this project. This is the time of year where, you know, you might want to stay close to the freezer, the heat making you cranky, even frustrated. But, you know, it is downright dangerous, and we all know that. So that's why Jerry Brown is here with St. Mary Food Bank and teamed up with Goodwill because you're looking for folks to bring out some water. Right. Goodwill is a great partner of ours year round. They allow us to drop off non-perishable food all during the year. But with the temperatures hitting 120 next week, we need water. So Saint, uh, so Goodwill is nice enough to be a St. Mary's drop off point. More than 70 locations around the valley and we're looking for bottled water. So it's got to be one in your neighborhood with 70 locations around the valley. Uh, and tell me a little bit about people can actually come pick up water next week as well. Monday, Tuesday, with it, Absolutely. Right? When the temperatures really hit yeah. that 120 mark, 119 mark next week at both of our Phoenix and Surprise locations, if you need a case of water, just come down. You can go right past the food lines at the Knight Center and out in Surprise, and we will we'll give everybody a case of water that needs it. Uh, Albertsons and Safeway has already stepped up with a great donation to get us started. That's not going to last very long, though. We need donations from the public. Uh, it costs up two or three bucks to pick up a, a case of water, and you can really help a family out. Okay, so today, tomorrow, over the weekend, come right. on by, uh, donate, and this makes a huge difference, doesn't it? Right, and as the temperatures are huge this weekend. It's oppressive heat, but it's a long, hot summer in the valley. St. Mary's needs a lot of water, so anything you can bring. The 16-ounce bottles are probably the best for us, but anything that's a closed container of water we'll happily accept. Tell me about the need that you see with the people who come to you. Absolutely. You know, a lot of the people that have trouble buying food, they also have trouble paying the electric bills. So those are those are the folks that the utility, the thermometer, they can't bring that uh, th those temperatures down in their house to make up for that. They're going to be sweating it out a little bit, a little bit of uh, bottled water, staying hydrated, especially for the elderly as well. Very important for us. So if you can help a uh, family stay hydrated for the summer, we'll all make this through together, right? Yes, yes we will, we'll as we always through. do at those Phoenicians. Thank you, <laughs> right. Jerry, for what you're you're doing and once again 70 goodwill locations around the valley there's got to be one in your neighborhood just a couple bucks pick up an extra case drop it off feel good know that you're helping out your fellow Phoenicians back mm -hmm. to you